Terrell Pryor was a changed man upon leaving the Ohio Bureau of Motor Vehicles today. His license was suspended two weeks ago, but now he can drive legally. Get your license back. Did you get your license back? He obviously didn't want to talk about it, but the Bureau of Motor Vehicles confirmed this afternoon he has shown proof of insurance and is now legally able to drive. Tuesday, NBC4 first reported Pryor's license was suspended after running a stop sign and he didn't have proof of insurance, yet he was still driving his Nissan 350Z when we spotted him outside the Woody Hayes Athletic Center. At the BMV today, his appearance was the talk of the office. He's calm. I mean, just talking to everybody, looking at everybody, smiling. Yeah, very happy in there. Yeah. He seemed very confident in there. He walked up and shook his hand and said, you know, I'm biggest fan and keep it going good. Pryor's attorney, Larry James, tells NBC4 that not having proof of insurance was a lapse of judgment. As for the car Pryor is driving, a 2007 Nissan 350Z, James says it is his third car since arriving in Columbus. Any other cars he drove were loaners while he was having his other cars worked on. He also says the cars were purchased by his mother, who is a lab tech, making between $14 and $17.50 per hour. He says the 2007 Nissan was purchased for $11,000, a car he now legally is allowed to drive. In Columbus, I'm Mike Bowersock, NBC4.